Hey, everybody, Ann here, sitting here having my coffee. Looks like it's going to be another one of those damp, rainy days. Not sure what all I'm going to get done. I'm going to go check on the chickens and, uh, I don't know, maybe just hang out. Well, what do we have here? This dog has come up onto my property many times. Not exactly sure who it belongs to, but I've seen it out in the middle of the street many times. And uh, I'm pretty sure it's a he-dog. Oh, yeah, I think that's a he-dog. Very friendly. Um, I don't, I don't know who he belongs to, but he just keeps coming up here. He doesn't seem aggressive with the chickens. And he's just very friendly. I don't know. What should I do, guys? Hey. Hey, sweet puppy. I don't know. Did God send you to me? <laughs> you hungry? Whew. It's got a collar on, so it belongs to somebody. I don't know. I'm just going to wait and see. If he hangs around. If he does. I don't know. Maybe I have a new dog. You're a good, gentle doggy. Very sweet dog. Look, he's got these stickers all over him. And it's like he's been going through the brush, trying to live out in the wilderness. Look at him. There's another one. These things, when you're going through the woods, they just pick up on you. You sweet thing. Well, if you stick around, I'm going to go get you some food. I just took him to the property that I think he belongs to. Mr. Lucas said he thought he belonged to the people that lives right next door to him. So I went and knocked on their door, and nobody answered. But um. I just kind of let him go because he seemed hesitant to leave. So I let him run free and he ran in the back where the other dogs were. And um, he's still there. So I'll tell you what. If I see this dog running loose again, comes up on my property, especially if he goes into the middle of the street, he's going to be my dog. That's all there is to it. Well, I dropped him off over there. I went over to talk to Mr. Lucas. We had a talk about this beautiful baby. And it is decided that he's my dog. Come on. He doesn't like being on a leash. But uh, I left that property I was at and um, walked over to Mr. Lucas. And all of a sudden, I see this guy trotting up back to me. So... He's my dog now. Okay, he's inside the house. Whew, it's a mess in here. Let's see how they do. I can already tell they're going to be just fine. This dog has perked up. He has gone from being sullen and unhappy to being perked up. All right, I'm, I'm going to stop filming this and supervise very closely, but... This is my new dog. Yep. I'm going to make sure he gets some food and gets comfortable. Okay, this is really hard for you to see, but I just put some food down. Judy, Judy, Judy. He's hungry. This boy is hungry, so I gave him one plate. Judy. I gave her another plate. I'm just going to let him eat. He needs to eat. He is hungry. His ribs are showing. All right, Judy, that's enough. Come on. Look at this poor boy. He ate it all up. Oh, on my floor. No, Judy. You're a good boy. Okay, that's enough food for you right for right now. Let's just see how you go along inside the tiny house. He's still hungry. 
I don't want him to gorge himself because then I'm afraid he'll just start vomiting. <sighs> They're smelling each other. You know, Judy loves other dogs. I don't know how this one is going to be, though. Very, very friendly with me. Very friendly with chickens. <laughs> oh, yes. Yes. All right, so we're just going to see how this goes. They're playing around like they're best friends ever. S excuse my messy place. It's got stuff all over the place. I don't even care. Look at. Look at they love each other. Oh, yes. I got a new puppy. What am I going to name him? I was hoping somebody answer our door. At least let me know what his name was. So, you guys, what are we going to name this guy? He's a beauty. I gotta get him to the vet. Look, dude, he's happy. <sighs> I think they're gonna get along just fine. <laughs> Look at that dog. Maybe a little bit skinny. You can't see it here, but his ribs are showing. He's just been wandering the neighborhood for weeks. Look at him. Just look at him. He's gorgeous. Oh, he found the water good. I have a feeling I'm going to be needing a lot more dog food. They're best buddies. Already. Whew. I had just been to the groceries over there. I need to put everything away. Look. This is now my dog. I'm starting to relax. This dog has eaten two bowls of food. Judy could not be happier. This is my dog. I'm not going to be having this dog running out in the middle of the street. Rolling through the sticker bushes. Oh, that's right, Judy. Be a good hostess. My floor is so dirty. I need to vacuum. Oh, look. I think they love each other. <laughs> they do. <coughs> He's so calm and Judy is so crazy. <coughs> Judy, <coughs> come on, just chill out. Let the guy relax. <coughs> He's been out in the wilderness. Come here, Papa. Oh, you pretty dog. Judy! I know you're excited. Look at this dog. I realize it's really dark in here, and the, the sun has gone down for a couple of hours, and this dog is just laying over here by my feet, completely relaxing. Him and Judy are getting along just fine, like two peas in a pod, and this dog is just like, I don't know, he, he it just seems like he's relieved. Um, oh, come on now. He doesn't want Judy bothering him. He just wants to relax right now, and Judy keeps wanting to play, and he is just relaxing. So, yeah, this is my dog. This is my dog. I've named him Papa, and he's going to be a very good dog. Just look at him. He's so sweet. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you in the next video.
Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.